Hello all, and welcome back to Pussy Town. This is your host speaking, MacGyver. In today's episode, we'll be continuing our 7 Days to Die Let's Play series, Red Hood's Point of View. If you do enjoy this, please head down below, like, comment, and subscribe. And if there's anything you'd like the community to know, please leave that down there as well. Thank you for watching, and God bless. Now let's get to it, guys. This has been awesome. We will see you guys in the next episode when we start the zombie mission. So, see you guys, and God bless. Where are you at, Redhead? Right behind you. I was laying down platforms since I couldn't jump for some reason. Oh, if you can, put down your torch when you're not, when you're doing stuff, so that, uh, I don't have to worry about it. Like, you can actually see what we're doing. A level up. You're now level 10. You have one skill point added. Oh, that's beautiful. I have two points available. Okay. While that reloads. Ooh, sciency. I got one point available. Ooh, we're going to do intelligence. Engineer. Engineer. Advanced items faster. Oh, you now are out of storage, stone age, and advanced, uh, gain 50% electronics, trap kills, uh, craft loot cheaper. I don't really care about that, actually. Um, lucky pick. Um, burglar, you can start to make a name for yourself, you can pick log services faster, uh, I think you have that one. I just got two levels of scavenging. Agility? Uh, you are still loud and clanky, but you can deal... Actually, ooh, there was one I really wanted to do. Um, where was it? Where are you? Oh, right here. Shadow. Hide in the shadows more effectively, noise activities muffled by 10%. Bye. This is the next one I'm gonna buy. Um, put my torch. Okay, down we go. Uh, gonna get out the gun. Oop, damn, I should not fall, so I get hurt. So, you were able to make the cells after we ran a book? Make so we can always make them. It's just that uh, I kind of forgot they existed and until I was like looking through some notes and whatnot. I'm like, oh yeah, there's a, a lovely handy dandy shovel we can use. So I always knew that there was a shovel. Empty rusty barrels. It's gonna destroy everything. Because it's free material and it's gonna, when we start the. Oh, you mean starting those? It's free material, why not? Um. Yeah, check all the materials. I found a garbage bag. I noticed. I didn't notice it before because we didn't have a flight. Yeah, I don't wanna break that one down. We got other stuff to do. Uh, do you have enough? So, were you able to, are you able to make a, um, There's a zombie in here somewhere, and they can are run! Red Hood, Red Hood, Red Hood! There's a zombie in here somewhere, and they can run. I don't know where they are, but they're here somewhere. Alright, just be wary. And oh, yeah, yeah so I'm be kind of coming back on my volume. Yeah, you can have your volume on, just have it on low. There was music in the loading screen, I think that's why I don't do it. Okay. Well, at least it's not in, like, GTA or anything like that where all the music is copyrighted. <laughs> That'd be really annoying. I'll just turn off the music. Yeah, if you play, if you play GTA, you can't have it done on the radio. Oh, really? Mm hmm It's like, whenever stream will play them, like, oh, and again, it calls, like, crap, 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 turn it turn it off, turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. It reminds me of, like, Jurassic Park, where, like, they're doing something, and they're, like, 
turn off the oh it's flashlight turn off the flashlight because the chick's playing with the flashlight well and there's a t-rex right outside the door it's like i want to eat you oh if you guys didn't know so the way they got the cup to vibrate the, the water they had a st uh, string underneath the car and there was someone underneath the car and they were plucking the string now you know i wonder if this is stuff can I make air? Oh, jump me! Is he dead? He is now. I only had my silver and I was whacking it. <laughs> Alright, that's 20 arrows for me. Alright. Torch. Um. Oh, good. I was like, you should probably wait till daytime to uh, start the mission. But now that it's daytime. Uh, How do you know when daytime? Uh, every time that the next day starts, uh, music goes off. So that doom doom oh. doom doom is uh, the next I day. I hold it for a second. Okay, now we're gonna go upstairs. Oop, can't leave the trash. And then, when the day starts, we will get, or when we start the mission, hopefully things will spawn the way I think they will. Okay. Now. So, do you have any, um... Oh, good, it did. Everything respawned. I love that when that happens. That's such a, uh... Oh, so now we need to go through here again? Yep, we go through again, but everything has respawned. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah, that's why I'm like, Red Hood. Like, we gotta go through this first. So, let's pick this stuff up on the way home, Red Hood. On the way back. Let's go through all the zombies, and then, uh... Then come back, okay? Oh. I think there's some loot right here. For the love of heat! My guy will. You mean loot right here? Oh, generator. No, Red Hello. Hood, stop! What are you doing? We get in there later, Red Hood. That's the thing we get to at the end. I was doing it that we can remember. Red Hood, you literally get there if you follow the, the road. Stop being stupid before I kick you. Oh, that's the end one. Yes. Uh, there was a zombie that dropped down here before, so maybe you'll do it again. So, the zombie placement isn't confirmed. Hit the dang zombies. I can do a large amount of damage. See, I just gotta hit them first. Down there somewhere. Good job, ready? Alright, see if Big Bertha's over there. Yep, I'm gonna step down and see if any zombies come out. Yep, there's somebody. Oh, it's Big George. I don't know if that's his name, but that's what I'm calling him. He's dead. We have names for each zombie type. I know there's names for them. I don't know all the names. I'm just calling them Big Bertha, George, and Theodore. Then you have the minor zombie. Yeah, we call it Big Mama. We call it Big Mama. It's Bertha. Mama. Big Bertha. You had that sledgehammer. Me too. I remember you. You told me you got one, and I was rewatching the video, so I was like, "Oh, that's what he said." I was like, mm, "I know this is good, even though I have no points in it." I woke them up, big. Right. Oh, Did you have to pick up the torch? He's dead, my guy. I'm on stamina. Hold still before I shoot you in the face instead of him. Yeah. 
Hold the dang torch while I go up this and get a sneak attack. Or not. Let's go. Torch, please. here now so might as well be able to see him There's gonna be a zombie sitting in this thing. Guess there wasn't this time. See, I knew there was some in here. Oh, they're in the back there. We just didn't have them fall down like last time. On behind us like this. I don't know. I think there's a door. Yeah, there's a door right here. That one's dead. Two in the knee. I think what happens is they actually spawn behind us, I think is what happens. I'm not sure. So apparently we haven't cleared the quest yet. No, we're done with it. We're done with trade off. Oh. I guess when I killed that last zombie, they must have finished. Why are you, like, breaking that the entire time? I really do feel stupid. It's the same level as the one I sold. Do we have enough ammo for both you and me to use it? No. <sighs> That's why I sold it. Like, you're better off using a different ammo type than me. Yeah, you're right. Priorities. Breaking stuff. We already went through there. We got all the stuff all these. There's someone trying to kill something or another somewhere. Oh, you're down there. No, very XP. Oh, I leveled up. Yeah, I know. I just killed a zombie. 
should have shot him with the bow, but eh, air is the same way. I love these because it's an easy way to get a whole bunch of stand dirt um, stuff for free. Well, not free. We're clearly getting it, but we don't have to put as much effort in. Um, are you going? Are you go learning what? What one are you? Hobbles. Are you learning engineering? I'm running all the like material making stuff and bow. Well, everything else I'm like not really learning, so. So medical, anything that's like good, I'm kind of running. Why do you have like um, books? Do you own hidden strike? What's it for? It's cast enemies. It better sneak it. Oh, give, 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 give. No, it's a skill. Oh, yeah, I just learned that one. Like I'm going into the sneaky stuff. You're going into the do not. So you should go into absorb pain one, or you can, you know. Be a brawler and not die. Because you're essentially brawling. That's essentially what you're doing. Honestly, no, that isn't me. So, right here, what you want to go into is. So, brain. No. The health one? Go with brawler. Uh, pain tolerance. Stuff like that. I would have pain tolerance. What level? One. I can't do any more yet. Um, so. This marked. Ooh, living off the land sounds nice. Save waypoint. X. Uh, airdrop. Oh, the huntsman. You think it's huntsman? Anybody number one Whatever. cat that gets in something is running away. Okay, we have that. So, we're definitely going to have to go around and get these airdrops. Next episode, I think. There's one that, uh, the one that just dropped isn't in the cold biome, so it's a lot better off for us. Um... Ooh, hey, um, Red Hood. Good. Um, what are you for stuff? Unless I can get another. No. Since I can't get another one on spears yet, I'm gonna loan skull. So, muscle. Red Hood, if you want to learn more on stuff, you have to, like, do attribute fort fortitude. You have to increase that. And then you can increase the other stuff and the level. Do I need to increase fortitude? So, you would go into, yeah, you'd increase fortitude to increase brawler or whatnot. If you want to increase spear mastery, which is under what? Yeah, to increase perception. How do I do that? So, spear mastery, you get to perception. You go into perception and you buy the stuff on the side. Okay. You're still unaware of, you're still aware of most things around you deal 2 10% headshot damage. Ooh, I should definitely get that one. What you got? I didn't get it. I I don't have any points. But I'm saying next time I level up, I should get the perceptions at level two, because you do 210% uh, damage on headshots. Oh, that sounds nice. Yeah, it's perfect for me. Since I'm a more melee character. It's perfect for anyone. If we have the resources, I wouldn't mind having a bow. What I'm angry. Oh, zombie ahead. Zombie ahead? Oh, cool. Dang, dang, no sneak attack. Oh, he's dead. Oh, we got a bag. Hey, that was my bag. I killed that one. What'd you get? It is all loot. True. <laughs> Communist hours. Every time I think we of that, to survive. I always think of Bugs Bunny, and he says hours, and it has like the, the, 
What do you want to give her that? Stupid... Uh, there was like some long something and sock on ammo. That way you drop. Okay, let's go back to the trader. To the trader. Oh wait, uh, Red Hood, what do you have for stuff? I want to like combine stuff so I I can get rid of some of this crap. Okay, I have square. I have rubble, like spray cans. Uh, do you have iron crossbow bolts? I have uh, iron arrow. It's getting dark. Let's just get going. It's whatever. It's only three hundred some meters. We can we can throw all of our stuff into one of the boxes there. And then we'll, I'll take what I can, and then you take what you can. Uh, he did. I go to get my arrow, and all of a sudden there's an axe flying over my shoulder. Lovely. Oh, even better. Uh, doesn't this place close at night? It's not nighttime just yet. That's why we have to hurry. Uh, you need to hold in like better than another quest. Pretty much. Because once we get seven quests done, then we can use bikes. What? Oh, ching ching. Bikes. Bikes. Bicycles? Yeah, ching ching, bikes. Yeah, and then and some more after that, we get more, more motorcycles. Where'd you and find this out? Oh, wait. I heard dummy quiet. Be quiet. Haha, -ha, sneak attack damage. Why are you still killing them? Oh no. That's just a sneak attack damage. Booyah. We are bam. For anyone who knows, that's actually from Age of Empires 2. Or 3. 3. Sorry. Where the guy, the musketeers, they say, Oh yeah, I know. Also, I'd love to wait out the storm. Actually, he's gonna kick us out at night, unfortunately. Um, so we can't wait out the storm at his place. So I'd rather not be wet. Being wet is how you get oh, sick and being sick and uh, you wouldn't die. Uh, we could always just lay a couple blocks of old heads until the storm is over. Oh, we have to get to his house before it gets dark. Because you're, you're going to hear our music go, go doo doo, and then it's going to get dark. Also, Trader John's going like, to uh, assume like announcements that says, uh, Shop closing. Yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of the baton when we get home. Next time we're home. Oh, yeah. I don't really use it. Uh. If you want to sell it, it's your thing. I gave it to you. You're, that's your melee thing. Why did you not go... Oh, you, I thought you were walking around. No. Uh, oh, what does the wound is gone? Nope. No, it doesn't. Did you get everything downstairs, too? Downstairs was locked. Is it? Oh. <laughs> Boo. Uh, right here, there is a box right here. I believe we can start... Oh, I was going to say we can put everything in. Ooh, yeah. books. <gasps> That's nice. <laughs> Tools to digest. Well, that's something I definitely want to learn. So, okay. did you get a new quest? Well, uh, alright, would you like Bar Brawling Volume 7? It's a hard book to get sometimes. Would you like 60 ammo for my gun, 100 ammo for your gun, uh, 750 charcoal, or a, a serrated blade mod. My I my vote. I say my vote's the book because it can be hard to get those. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna do clear zombies again. Oh no, we have a clear. Oh, clear zombie right here. Five hundred and thirty-seven. I like those. They're pretty cool. All right. Item. Uh, see your inventory. Um. I think we bought. Wait, we won't. Did you get on World War too? Well done, I mean, managed to pulls. Oh, I think I get to pick something too. Uh, you don't want the pipe rifle. I'm gonna sell it, cause... No, I have different items. I have shredded blade mod, repair kits, ammo, wave digger mo mode, wooden split Pleasure doing mode, business with you. wooden splitter. Come back um... What are the mods? Wooden Splitter mod, Wave Dago mod, Slated Blade mod. Um. Thanks, anyways. No, you be careful out there. Um. 
Not sure. So, what are the things again? I'm sorry. Is there any books? No. Um, what are the other items? Just go through. Should I just go with the Salated Blade? No, because he offered that to me too, so it's pretty common. Um, Grave Digger? Go with the Grave Digger, because it's a pickaxe mod. I can use it for uh, uh, when we go mining. Get that one. You are hungry. Lovely. Um, it's a Seven mod. Yeah, it's for mining. I, may I see your inventory? Um, food. Medical. Uh, so I also asked for a job, or did you already have a job? I already got a job. Oh, alright, we have to go to the spending machine. I'm... I have one that's 400 meters away. Should I get it? Yeah, just get it. We can double up on jobs, because we probably won't be able to come back right away. Me with a little problem. Or at least not in I can't this thank video. You enough, Oh, did you leave? Oh, I went to the vending machine. Oh. Did you get the quest? So what was your quest? Oh. Rental. That was a kill zombie mod. Mine is 501, so we have 400. So, right ahead. Um, 400. Um, but we have to... Um, uh... So, come over here. My bad. We're gonna go in here, and I'm gonna throw in all the crap we have. Because we can leave stuff here. And I'm gonna do that. Um, lots of thing. I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna sell those. Uh, I'm gonna throw the book in there too for you. Um, and whatnot. Uh, can you eat these? Food help. Um,. Take from there. Should probably take the stone. This. Yes. Okay. Let's make some arrows. So I need to bring this book into my inventory and then read it. Do you mean stone? Or store it? I don't know. Yeah, about it. Thank you. Another Do you have any iron? Uh, yeah, I'll take the iron. I'll take iron, stone, and wood right now. I'm keeping my wood. Oh yeah, you should definitely keep Do you your wood. Lead? Uh, throw the lead in the in the thing if you can in the workbench. It's very full. Um, so. Get out of the workbench for a minute. I'm taking the mod out and putting this lead. Get out of the workbench for a minute. I want to, I want to get in there. Um, we went already up one on time. There we are, bro. Uh, we might actually want to run home because I'm starving. Okay, I'm actually starting okay, to get Okay, I eat. grabbed everything I could. Grab everything I left in. Wait, did you, like, fill your inventory to do? No. No, where's the gate? Are you overburdened? Yes. Uh, drop everything. I grabbed literally everything I could. Alright, Redhead, come out here. He's gonna kick us out anyways. Drop everything that you're overburdened with. Give it all here. Cause I have more than enough inventory slots. Trader Joel's is now closed. Now closed. Okay, I'm gonna go up these, these. Alright, hurry up, hurry up. Oh, you had this one at the time. I saw that. Well, that's the... Alright, uh, you can't take any more items? I'm dropping some more things, plus I have some room. You need me to pick up something? Yeah, uh, take this. Oop, 
I mean, I want to scrap it. I want to drop it. And I want you to take... Um, do you have any clay? No. Paper. I have, like, good money that I can sell. Do you have concrete mix? Uh, Red Hood, do you have, every, I have what you had. Like, all of my stuff I had that was extra got thrown in there. I don't have any of that stuff anymore. Okay, my inventory is full. Do you care anymore? So just gonna drop that. You can leave that. I'm not, it's rotten flesh. I'm not uh, okay. Um, I'm gonna drop the cloth. I don't really need it. Let's get home. And we'll try, we'll end off the video there. Oh, we should, we didn't lay a, we didn't push this thing off at home, did we? Oh no, we have a bed thing. It shows our beds. Yeah, I'm like really hungry. Alright. And it's severely, se um, severely uh, hampering my stamina. Alright, I uh, probably shouldn't have the torch out, so. But oh well. I won't be able to see you guys to see. But, I don't think we'll be able to get home before the end of the episode, so we will see you guys in the next episode. Thank you. Ah! Kill it! All right, we gotta go. We have to move. We have to move. You just shot a gun out and, and without being quiet. Well, I have no stamina. Red Hood, don't shoot guns at night, unless you have me, who has a silencer. Because well, everything out here can sprint. I was killing it. Hello, and thank you for watching. This has been Red Hood's Point of View, Day 10 of our 7 Days to Die Let's Play series. If you did find yourself enjoying this, please head down below, like, comment, and subscribe. As always, thank you for watching, and God bless. If you'd like to see you use your fan art going forward for the sign credit, please leave a comment down below, and we'll reach out to you. Thank you for watching, and God bless, and we'll see you guys all next time.